this right? All right, guys, yeah. What's going on, Dan? She yelling loud? Who the hell is that? I'm close to the door. Yeah, I decided to just do a little quick little vlog, you know, kick it with y'all. Uh, it's my first time doing a vlog like this, so I don't know exactly how this is supposed to go, but I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. All right. Damn it. So, yeah, I'm going to do a video log. Today, I'm going to just talk about what's going on. Uh, oh, yeah. Happy happy Revenge of the Sith Day. Today was the, uh, I guess, the 15th anniversary of Revenge of the Sith. We get a lot of good memes from that <laughs> that movie, so counts for something. Some people don't like the movie. I actually kind of do like the movie. I like Star Wars in general, so yeah. But anyways, uh, I'm gonna just talk about my day, which was I finished doing a video. I put a video up, so you better go watch that video. It was up and ready to go. I pranked my mom. She was, oof, that didn't turn out too well. I don't know how people do prank videos, like, you have to really low key be an asshole, and I'm not gonna be an asshole. But it's fun to do though. It is fun to do, and see people's reactions to it. But yeah, man. Uh, see, you're gonna see a whole lot of more prank videos from me, and just you're gonna see a whole all kinds of different videos from me. You seeing a vlog from me right now? I'm gonna do prank videos. I'm gonna do reviews on just like other just stupid videos, and just to entertain you guys. You know, just to keep. You guys entertained. Are you not entertained? You know, whatever that meme is. But yeah, um, other than that, I finished that video. My girl is over at her mom, so I'm home by myself. Kind of bored, actually. I was going to watch some Yu-Gi-Oh. I actually am a big, big fan of Yu-Gi-Oh. I love fucking Yu-Gi-Oh. I'm actually watching the new season of it called Brains. I think it's called Vrains, V-R-A-I-N-S. I think I spelled that right. If I didn't spell it right, don't don't be mad at me, you know? But yeah, I love the Yu-Gi-Oh, you know? If you love Yu-Gi-Oh, let me know in the comment section. Maybe we can get a duel going on. <laughs> you feel me? But yeah. Uh, what else to talk about? See, this is this is hard because I'm it's a new channel. I don't have you guys to tell me what to talk about yet. You know what I'm saying? I need a whole fan base, a community. Which is which I really I really want you know I really want to have a community so we can go out and spread more fun and joy. It's, it's too much anger out and about nowadays. So much hate, you know. We need more love and more fun. Life is fun, you know. I'm just tired of people just being angry all the time. And ooh, my hand hurts from holding the camera so long. People are always angry, you know. And life is just life is too short to be angry all the time. So. Whatever your dream is in life, go do your dream. Don't let nobody tell you you can't do your dream. Only thing stopping you is you, you know? And I realize that. So that's why I'm doing this, you know? Especially since I'm like a introverted person. I learned that yesterday. I'm like at this, I guess you could say it's a birthday party. Not really a birthday party. It's just like a birthday get together. And at first I was hanging out. We was playing dominoes and then. I went back to editing a video just kind of by myself. And I was thinking like, damn, I'm kind of, I'm, I am introverted, huh? I am an introverted person, but I can't be, you know, social, but like, I don't know. I like to keep a very close circle. I'm a very close circle ass person. <laughs> you feel me? But yeah, life is good though. You know, you just got to enjoy it. Stop looking at all the negatives. Some people just only see the negatives, you know? And life is just... It's way more positives than negatives in life. Yeah, there's some crucial shit going on, and people are out of jobs and stuff. But, hey, you still got your fam. You still got health, hopefully. Some people don't have health, you know? But they still got life, you know? You know, I know a lot of people who are just not even alive right now who died at a young age. And if you're alive right now... And you're over the age of 11, 10, 9, you know what I'm saying? You are you you have a good life. You still tripping, still tripping. Man, I'm telling you, man, being YouTubers is difficult. There's so many little things that that are behind the scenes that you guys just don't even know about that just gets so frustrating when it comes to recording and just trying to 
get the quality right and the, you know, the audio right and all that stuff, you know what I'm saying? It's just so much stuff that goes involved. The hell was that? But yeah, I'm just chilling here. I'm thinking about getting, making something to eat. I might make some pancakes. Your boy loves pancakes. I love waffles too. Oh, something about just waffles and pancakes is just, it's just fight, man. I don't know who invented those two things, but he was a fucking genius, whoever the fuck that was. But yeah, man, what am I going to eat? I kind of do want pancakes, but I want like some food food. Kind of kind of feel like being a fat ass, just getting a burger. But, you know, it's so much better just to eat at home. I got some like taco meat in there. I might make some tacos or something. Tell me in the comment section right now what you what you guys be cooking at home. I know it's um everybody's at home right now because of whatever's going on. And so I know you're cooking. Well, hopefully you're cooking. I know some people are actually eating out a lot. I I, I like to get um what's it called? It's not Uber Eats. I get Grubhub. I'm always Grubhub is my jam, boy. Grubhub come through. Cause man, I love to get my Thai food. I love to get my barbecue and stuff. So I always order that stuff up. It's expensive because you got to pay for the extra delivery charge, but man, it is worth it. Especially Thai food. I love Thai food. Like I can just live in Thailand like forever and just be good. The internet is probably sucky over there, but man. But yeah, food is my, my thing. I love food. <laughs> I was actually a chef for like, uh, actually a world famous a restaurant called Chef Marilyn's. I was the chef over there for a cool little minute. She was actually on BuzzFeed and got the, um, you know how BuzzFeed does those videos where it's like um, $3 food versus $300 food. She actually won the challenge because she was the $3. She was the lowest one and she beat all the rest. So they said that she had the best macaroni. And so I agree. (laughs) I was making that macaroni for like, a good year, you know? So I actually know how to whip it up. I know make some fried chicken, collard greens, soul food. I'm your boy. I can make some other stuff too. I need to work on my baking, honestly. But I've had some crazy jobs though. Been a home care worker. Right now I'm doing security, which is, it's cool, it has its perks. It's when I have to deal with like homeless people. That gets like hell of annoying, you know, just dealing with people who are just out of their minds. If you do, if you have a crazy job where you have to deal with people who are just not compliant, who just do not want to listen to anybody, it, I swear it's like the most difficult job in the world, man. You just, you just want to just just burst, and you just gotta keep your composure, man. For reals. That's why I give a shout out to uh, police officers. They have a hard job, honestly. They really do. All right, let me order this food. So, yeah, I decided I am going to get me a burger. Uh, Let me order this food. What do I want, though? I'm going to get me, like, a double cheeseburger. Yeah, I'm going to be a fat ass today. Hi, right, I was trying to get a um a double cheeseburger combo. W. With like a uh, strawberry shake. Uh, you want the soda? No soda, just a shake. Oh, okay. That's it? Yeah, that'd be all. Thank you. Thank you. So there it is. Yeah, I'm going to get this burger. And I love this place because it seemed like as soon as I order it, it's already done. Like... They literally finish everything and like, I've never had an order take more than 10 minutes for them to make, you know? All right, so we are on our way to get this burger. I need some light, god damn. Where the light at? There you go. Going to get this burger. Double cheeseburger out there. I'm about to fuck this shit up. 
And this place actually really has pretty good burners, burgers, burners, burgers. You know what I'm saying? Ah. One thing about being a YouTuber, you gotta have good speaking skills. You gotta be able to pronounce all of your words. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, about to go scoop up this food real quick. And like I was saying, this place has good burgers. I've had pretty bad burgers from like random burger joints, but I've been going to this burger spot since I've like moved over here. And if you didn't know, I actually live, like you can tell by the graffiti, <laughs> in LA, you know what I'm saying? And not a savory spot in LA either. I'm not one of those YouTubers who live all the way in downtown LA or Hollywood or whatever. No, I live right in the heart of LA, South Central. So yeah, at any moment, anything can happen. It's like living in the wild, I guess you could say. <laughs> but no, nah, it's okay. As long as you keep your little defensive tools, you'll be all right out here. Keep keep to yourself, don't bother nobody. Don't mean mug nobody, just, you know, keep to yourself. That's one thing a lot of people mess up is that they come to LA and they just be nosy and just, they think everybody is just nice. And yeah, a lot of people are nice out here, but you really want to just keep to your business. You never know who or what is doing what or who. It's, it's just a real mess out here. The most grimiest person out here will look like the most not grimiest person out here, you know? And then it's, it's the complete opposite. The most, the person you think looks shady, he'd be the nicest guy, you know? So yeah, we're almost here. Let's go get this burger. Bye, bye. How you doing? Uh, order for pickup? Double, Double cheeseburger. See what I'm saying? It's done already. Quick. You can't see me at all. No. Quick. Got a cool little position on it. You guys seen it? Got my little position on it. What's the damage? Fourteen dollars. Fourteen dollars. Here you go. Shake. Bro, what trick can you do? Can you do any tricks? Huh? Can you do any tricks? Tricks? Yeah. What tricks can you do? Uh, wow. Here, I'm recording. Do one for me. Anything, anything. You can do all these. Oh. One more time. This is the police coming on shit? <laughs> Gas, police running up and everything. All right, bro, thanks. Guys, see, I told you, I live in the hood. So, I can't record and walk at the same time, so I'm going to end this right now, okay? I'll see you guys when I get back home. All right, so I made it back home. Got my double cheeseburger. Got my... Sh no. I almost spilled my strawberry shake. Oh, I'm about to be so mad, you guys. Oh my, I don't know. Got my double cheeseburger. See what I'm saying? It's a good little burger. It's a good little burger, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, I'm about to end this video here. I'm about to tear this shit up. If you like the content, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. You know, I'm here for you. All right, catch you guys on the next one.